You are a mean green crafting machine, so you save everything. And sometimes you go out of your way to look for something in a particular shape box because you know you need that box. So the last time you went to the bagel store, you bought a dozen, because this is just too cute not to use. You need it for a gift box. But it's a pretty thin cardboard. So the first thing you'll do is take it outside and give it two good coats of any color paint that you like. I used silver. And that's going to fortify the cardboard a little bit but you're gonna need some felt on the inside to fortify it a little bit more. So you'll set your box down, either right on the felt you're gonna use or other thick material or on paper, and you're gonna draw around the sides right up to the top edge. Cut it out, you're gonna Give each side a good, smooth, thin coat of original tacky glue. And then you'll lay your felt in and let it dry. Now, you still have two weak points. One on this side and one on this side. And it's the perforated place that you push out to put your cream cheese on. You don't want to put cream cheese there. So that's why you're super glad that you saved this fabulous plastic wrapping paper for just this occasion. You're so smart. You're going to cut hearts out and you're going to stick them over the perforated area. I've centered the point. Smooth it on the best you can. Here's the pattern that I made for the larger side of the top so that it covers the perforated and cut part. I'm using Aline's No Sew Glue for fabric to glue it in place and I'm only going around the edges. Right up to the edge. And then when that's dry, then you get to have some fun. So I've got two glitter pens that I'm going to use to finish up decorating this box. So you glittered it all up and you let it dry overnight and now you're ready to tie it up. Very pretty. So here's a little bit of wired ribbon. And I'm going to tie a bow just like that. And there you have a gift box from a bagel box. I hope you enjoyed this project. I hope that you're inspired to try something like it. I'm Candace. You stay crafty, my friends.